Welcome back to Magic Tarot Cards. This is Jasmine. This is your love bonus reading for all Zodiac signs for November 2024. Let's see what's coming in for all Zodiac signs. You know what to do. Trolls, you know where your exit's at. Other than that, text me for a reading. The number's down below. Let's get started. Let's see what's coming in for love. All Zodiac signs. We're going to go ahead. Oh, wow. Look at that. We're not going to use that one. I do work directly with Spirit. Spirit pulls the cards. All right. Let's see what's coming in for November. I see a card flipped here. There it is. Again, we're not going to use that one. All Zodiac signs on November 2024. What's coming in? All Zodiac signs on November 2024. All Zodiac signs for November 2024. All Zodiac signs for November 2024. One more card. All right, first we have the Ten of Cups. This is a great card to have. This is the card of marriage. This is the ult ultimate dream. When you're married, you have a home, you have children. Here we are with the people underneath the rainbow. They're very happy. They're in deep thought about their life. They have children and they have a home. All these cups represent the good things coming in. You have family, love, friends, money. Whatever you want is a, is a possibility. So some of you will be celebrating that with the Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio is coming in to offer you love. Or marriage, so be looking out for that. Some of you are going to be have money issues in November, but it's not going to be for long. This is the Ace of Pentacles when money is coming in. This is the coin represents money, hand from the universe bringing it in, but it's in stagnation. It doesn't mean that it's going to never come. It just means it's on hold for a little bit. Why? Because in in November we're going to be having a Mercury retrograde, a slow down. Everything's going to slow down because you're going to have two planets Mer uh, retrograde. You're going to have Mercury and Mars, so they slow things down. So the bonus, the rays. The, whatever it is that you're waiting pertaining to money is going to come at a slow pace. Okay, here it is again. And this is for, I'm thinking this is for uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Here it is again. Here, there's the hope of money. He's wanting that money to bring it in. The horse brings it in, but the horse is standing still. He's dark, black, meaning he's depressed because the money hasn't come. He wants peace and calm, but it just, this money will bring peace and calm. A brand new day for him, but it hasn't come yet. So he's standing still. He's waiting. He's hoping for this money to come in. So pray it in, wish it in, because it is coming. It's just coming at a very slow pace. All right. Then again, we have another marriage card for Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. I'm seeing someone getting married um, between four months and four years. Someone's coming in to offer you this great love. This is great love, happy, abundant home. I'm seeing a child being born from an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. And then there's people celebrating in the background. So uh, this is love, great love and abundance coming in for some of you in November. Okay, and then you have the uh, Fool. Now, some of you are going to be going on a new adventure. You're putting everything behind, leaving, going on a new adventure. But don't be like the Fool and fall off the cliff because he's not paying attention to the detail of his steps. See, he's about to fall off the cliff. He's happy. He's packed his bags. He's in deep thought. His, his deep thought is here. But he's not paying attention. So, and other people are warning him. The dogs are warning him. And the little bag, if you notice, has a face. And it's saying, oh, no, oh, no, you know, you're about to fall off the cliff. So th what this represents is when you get a new opportunity, pay attention to the detail. You know, don't sign contracts in November or towards the end of November and December because you'll miss a clause in it because we will be retrograding with Mercury and Mars. All right. So be careful what steps you take in the month of November. And for if this reading is for November, then you're going to have to be careful because you might make a mistake in any new adventure that you take. Just check out all the t details of every step that you take. That's mainly the message here. And then some of you are going to be returning from the past. Of course, Mercury Retrograde brings in past people, past lovers, past friends. So a lot of you are going to be vi revisiting the past 
uh, reunions, uh, thinking about the past or going into the past or wishing you were in the past and then vice versa. The past is going to come to you. Someone in your past is going to be looking for you, revisiting you, wanting to spend some time with you. This is childhood memories. This is, this is the card of uh, nostalgia when you go into the past, thinking about the past. So a lot of you going to have people from the past coming in, ex-lovers, ex-friends, ex-relatives, or people that you haven't seen in a very long time are going to want to come see you, come talk to you. So that's actually a good thing. Just be careful with the exes that, um, uh, how you say, want to uh, mess with you a little bit. Now let's do a oracle card. Let's do the sexy, crazy love notes. I have them here. Uh, I keep everything in, in ten boxes. All right, so this is sexy, crazy love notes. And let's pull one card for all zodiac signs. Um... I'm going to do one card. These are cute little cards. And this is one you actually have to read. So we're going to... Uh, let's do this one since it fell out. You know, y'all don't have my glasses with me, so I'm going to get as close as possible. What does it say in the front? Listen to your body. Okay, what does that say? Listen to your body. No matter how bad we feel, our bodies are always working on behalf to create... On our behalf to create... Sorry, y'all don't got my glasses. To create health and... Um, let me get my glasses, y'all. Hold on. Okay, that's better. Okay, so we have to create health and vitality. Meet your body halfway by acting on the messages it sends you. Whether it's a whisper or a roar, don't ignore what you hear. Listen to your body. It wants the best of you. So that is correct. So if your body is telling you, you know, if you're having certain pains, a certain feeling that you don't normally have, then your body is telling you to stop, pay attention. Maybe you need a checkup. Maybe you need to um, uh, visit a doctor. Or just listen to your body and what it's telling you to because your body is the one that's working for you, and then you have to work for it to make it better, be better. All right? You want to be you always stay healthy and strong. So... Listen to what your body is telling you. If you have a if you have pain anywhere, and that's not normal. Your body should never have pain of any kind. So if you're having some kind of pain or some kind of issues, then it's time to visit a doctor. You know, check into it, have an exam or whatever it is, because you want to stay healthy and strong to live your life. All right, that's the message for today. Listen to your body. Thanks for watching, y'all. This is Jasmine for Magic Tarot Cards. Don't forget, if you want a personal reading, you can contact me. Um, with the with the telephone number down below. All you do is text. You don't have to go to no website. You don't have to email me. You don't have to do anything like that. Just text me. Tell me your name. Say, you know, this is my name, and I want a the three card special or whatever reading you want. Because I have other readings too, but I am having the three card special for the rest of the year. So it's gonna be November and December. You get three cards for ten dollars. Actually, it's eleven because you have to pay a dollar fee. But also, you don't just get a tarot reading here. You also get a spiritual reading because everything here comes from spirit. It doesn't just come from um, the cards. I don't just read cards. I'm telling you actually what spirit is telling me to tell you. All right, so you always get messages from spirit when, you're re when I'm reading for you. All right, it's not just a regular tarot card reading. All right, so jump in on that special. Text me, make your appointment. You can have it any time between now and December, the end of December. Okay, don't forget to tell your friends about me. All right, thanks for watching. This is Jasmine from Magic Tarot Cards.